Good day everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today yet another property review. Today we are reviewing Level at Kuala Lumpur. So basically Level at Kuala Lumpur is a mixed development. At the bottom there you have uh, shop lots, business shop lots. And at the top you actually have four blocks of residential units. So there are a total of 1,200 residential units uh, with three layouts. Yeah? The smallest is 750 square feet. Uh, two bedroom, two bathroom, that's what we're going to review today. And uh, the biggest is approximately 1,000 square feet. Uh, that's a three bedroom and two bathroom unit. So the location of this level is very strategic. Yeah, Right beside it, you have your Cheras District Police Headquarters. And if you walk further down this road, that is basically Jalan Cheras. And around the corner, you actually have uh, Sunway Velocity Mall. So that's less than 500 meters walking distance, yeah? This apartment, service apartment, this is the UNA service apartment. It's a leasehold development. By the way, level is freehold, yeah? While this, uh, this UNA service apartment is uh, leasehold. And if you know, notice that nearby here is also the famed uh, M Vertica depart, uh, service apartment. That is also leasehold, yeah? So this particular one, uh, freehold. And right behind me, you actually have a secondary school. Yes, SMK Yakob Latif. So let's head towards the lobby. It's the drop off for uh, block A and B. Uh, block C is on the other end. Uh, so yes, we'll walk towards the other end because the unit that I'm going to review is uh, is in block C. So again, this is the, the drop off uh, for block A and B. You might hear of uh, Level before. It was actually in the news uh, a couple of years back because uh, back in 2016, uh, during the Olympic Games, the owner of this uh, developer basically gifted uh, Dato Li Chongwei a unit here at Level. So if you're lucky enough, you might just come across the Dato Li Chongwei. Yeah. Okay, let's head towards Block C Lobby. Okay, we are at the other end of the development. So basically, that is the lift lobby of block C, uh, the block that we are going to review shortly. And right behind me, if you noticed, this is Aeon Maluri. So yes, it's damn near. Uh, literally down from the lobby, you can walk across to Aeon Maluri and that's like, what, 50 meters perhaps? And over that side there, yes, that's towards Taman Maluri. So you have a lot of uh, businesses there, very, very mature business area. Uh, you have banks, pharmacies, clinics, uh, very very mature area. Okay, don't need to explain too much about that. Uh, let's head towards the lift lobby. Coming up from the lift lobby, this is on the 19th floor. We are on the block C. Uh, and yes, very wide lobby. Yeah, it's a good 8 feet, I would say. And look at that, you have very nice uh, lighted plates. Again, this is something uh, not common for you know, a condo at this price point. Yeah. So this is the entrance. So right off the entrance, as you enter, you will notice that you have your dry kitchen uh, on your left hand side. And it comes with built-in kitchen cabinets. So the furnishing, uh, I would say it's very good. Uh, if you look at the sink, uh, it's a Teka sink. And even the hood hob, also by Teka. Microwave oven built-in, also by Teka. Yeah. And this is towards the yard area. So a very sizable and usable space. Uh, I would say it's generously wide. And this, you have another area which is uh, for your washing machine. Yeah, you can see the, the, the water outlet there. There's also actually a built-in uh, built induction. The, the fan, basically the exhaust fan, goes out and leads out here. So if actually you see the units opposite, right, you will notice that there's the, there's the external exhaust uh, uh, out there. Yeah. So all units, uh, they come with built-in uh, built -in hood and hop, and you have a... Uh, it's, um, it's ventilation, uh, they basically pull it out. So kudos to the developer uh, for this.
So that is the aircon, shared aircon for uh, your living and dining. The all the also all the aircon, the outdoor unit is basically at the yard area. They still have an aircon latch where you place the aircon there, so it does not use up your yard space or your balcony. Okay. So this is the balcony. So for this unit, it's a Type uh, A, 750 square feet, uh, two bedroom, two bathroom. Uh, all of these Type A units are actually facing inwards uh, towards the facilities, yeah, towards the swimming pool. So you would notice also that there's this development here. This is supposedly to be a platinum mirror. Uh, but this project basically has been cancelled. I think it went all the way up to uh, federal court and actually the nearby residents were complaining about uh, this development because you look at the density, right? You got uh, Amaya right there and you got uh, this development itself which is uh, level and to construct another <laughs> development is going to be extremely tight. So what happened is that this, court, uh, this case went all, went all the way to a uh, federal court case uh, and the federal court has instructed uh, DBKL to basically repurchase the land uh, and uh, uh, develop a road instead to connect from that area, you know, to, 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 to uh, this, this other part, to, to Taman Maluri. Yeah, so there'll be no uh, developments here, don't worry. Okay? So stepping back into the unit, we got a control alarm panel there. And taking a look at the first uh, bedroom. So very generous, uh, almost ceiling to floor height windows. This is the common bathroom. The owner has uh, fixed a water heater. And also, uh, the master bathroom for this unit very similar and this is the the master bedroom itself yeah. so again same view uh, like what I mentioned all block A or all type A units are facing inwards it's only the bigger units are uh, type B, type C, 850 and 960 square feet the three bedrooms are the one facing outside. That's the one that uh, overlooks uh, sunway velocity uh, you know, towards Jalan Charas. Okay, so that's the brief walkthrough of this particular unit. Uh, let's head down to the facilities floor. So stepping out of the lift lobby of level 9, this is basically the facilities floor. So the facilities floor is shared by all the four blocks. You actually have a small pool over here, but it's uh, yet to be in operations so there's a much bigger pool on the other end it's a olympic size a 50 meter lap pool and in this metal structure here you basically have a half court uh, badminton court yep so that's your half court badminton court rubberized floor you got some outdoor children uh, structure here and you have a very very generous kids uh, playground water equipment yeah so this on the level 9 again and you have some uh, facilities also on the level 10 uh, that there you see there is the management office you got a multi-purpose hall here, which they are currently using for, for BP. And towards that end there is also your hanging gym. Okay. Behind this structure here is their badminton court. So they named this badminton hall uh, after Li Chong Wei, uh, and I guess that's because of the deal that they they gave the two units. Uh, sorry, gave a unit uh, of a condo here to him. 
So very, very nice uh, badminton court. Uh, you got two courts actually. And even what looks like a viewing deck from the top. Yeah. So yes, uh, heading up from the badminton court. So that's your gym. So and this is the other end of the uh, the other end of the development. Yeah. There you can see uh, towards the end that is actually Sunway Velocity 2. And from here you can actually, I'm not sure if you can see the contrast might it might be a bit bright, but you can actually see IKEA, uh, you can see my town shopping center. Yeah. And this is the 50 meter uh, lap infinity pool. Yep. Olympic length. From that aim to this aim. Okay. Now going to the other part of the the development. So there are a few more facilities on this floor, we are going to explore that, but we are not going up uh, to the 10th floor because that is uh, just the management office, uh, the multi-purpose hall and so the gym. Uh, nothing really special about those. So this is your games room and you can see what we have inside. You've got a pool table, you've got a tabis, table tennis table and also you have a football table there. Yeah. This is the games room. You've got the reading room for you to do some work or read a book. And last but not least, I want to show you the view from this side. We got a few lounge here, chairs, uh, putting greens, two small putting greens, and yeah, lounge chairs. So again, we are on the ninth floor. So at the bottom here, this building is actually Aeon. So we are really just literally just beside uh, Aeon Maluri uh, you have M Vertica there uh, and this is the Churras district uh, police headquarters and that orange building over there uh, that's Sunway Velocity uh, Una service apartment and also uh, another Sunway uh, residential block Sunway Velocity 2 yeah okay so that's all. Thank you for watching again. Uh, if you like this video, do like it. Uh, do subscribe to my channel, support the channel, and see you in my next video. Bye!